I am Michael Santos with Prison to Paradise and I've got a very simple message. If you are not doing something right now to position yourself for success, you are struggling. The reality is, you may be going through some difficult times right now, and I don't know where you are because I make these videos for anybody who's going through struggle. I mean, I was in prison for 26 calendar years. I always like to throw that out there in the beginning so people know I'm not uh, giving some type of information that I don't know what I am talking about. I know what it takes to stay motivated and disciplined and committed through as days turn into weeks, weeks turn into months, months turn into years, and for some, as years turn into decades. Those are lessons that really got me through the journey is understanding I would always have to invest in myself. And my question for you, if you are living in struggle, is what are you doing today to invest in yourself? You see, we are really living in an era that is probably the best time of all humanity to be uh, able to lift yourself from struggle to prosperity, right? I mean, I went to prison when I was because of the stupid decisions that I made when I was 20 years old, but because I spent every single day through 9,500 days in prison thinking about how I wanted to come back home, how I wanted to become successful, I had a different outcome. And that message should translate into your life. Regardless of where you are, what are you doing today with the resources that you have around you to begin positioning yourself for success in the months, the years, and the decades to come? Now I'm sitting here making this video in the conference room of one of my clients that I do a lot of work with. In fact, I'm partners with this company. It is a real estate development, international real estate development company that develops amazing projects in Belize, in Costa Rica, Cabo San Lucas, the Bahamas. And it's, it might seem a little bit crazy why this company would hire or even partner or do business with a guy like me. Somebody did 26 calendar years in prison. But the reason that I can do that is because I can show them how hard I worked while I was in prison and how I can bring value to this company while I'm out here because I'm always learning skills. That's what I am suggesting that you do. In fact, one of the reasons that prompted this really impromptu, uh, quick video that I decided to make was a conversation that I had with the IT guy who works for this company. I mean, it's a big company. They've got you know hundreds of people who are working on site in their different developments around the world. They've got maybe 50, 75 people working right here in the Newport Beach area of California. And the IT department, plays a real central role in keeping everything moving because they've got all types of moving parts. They've got national television campaigns, Facebook ads, radio ads, and people hear that from all over the world. They hear that advertising. People then call in or visit the website and it's the IT department that is so successful in disseminating those leads of prospective people who might want to buy to sales professionals who work here, in uh, Orange County, California, as well as people that work on site. And they start building this library of people that play an essential role in keeping the entire machine moving. And I was talking with the IT guy about different ways that he could be preparing it himself to bring more value to his own career and to the company where he works. And one of the areas that I have found to be incredibly uh, promising is this whole concept of, of um, internet development. It's, it's, voice, vi it's voice, video, and, and uh, text word. The technology is evolving in such a way that it won't be very long before we are able to communicate with our clothes, with our belt, you know, with our cars, with everything. And Amazon is really making this possible at scale with this new device called the Alexa. Now, if you're in prison, obviously you don't have access to Alexa. But what Alexa can do is instead of going and writing something down or going to, to tell somebody to do something, you can just communicate to Alexa and disseminate this information wherever you want it to go. And truthfully, I don't understand all of the, I, I mean, I don't know anybody that does that could understand all of the ways that Amazon envisions Alexa being a part of our life. But one thing I absolutely know is if you, if an individual has some level of skill with technology, that person might want to be investing time 
to learn more about how to become an Alexa skill developer because I can absolutely guarantee that that is a skill that I would pay for because I develop programs, I develop content that I want to disseminate to as many people as possible. And I will need somebody who knows how to code this into Alexa to build different apps that will allow me to spread this message to more people. The reason that I want to spread this message to more people is because although I served 26 years in federal prison, since I've come back to society, I have met people in a much bigger prison than I was ever in. And it's the, the way that they think. It is their mindfulness. It is their belief that they can't really break out of where they are right now. They may not see possibilities. But one thing that 26 years in prison has conditioned me to see is that there are always possibilities. We don't have to live in the world with external influences that limit our prospects for success. We can always read a new book. We can always develop a new skill. We can always be thinking about what steps I can take today to make myself a higher earner tomorrow, to bring more value to more people tomorrow. Through Prison to Paradise, that's what I'm trying to do, is live this authentic life and showing people, regardless of what struggle you're going through, you can create a pathway to a higher level of success. Not as I define success, as you define success. I write about in this free book, Prison to Paradise, how I walked out of prison after 20, it was actually I was not even out of prison, I was in my, still in the halfway house after 25 years and I said that within five years I'd have my first million dollars worth of assets. And I can tell you when I made a statement like that, a lot of the people would say, this guy's crazy, he's been locked up too long. But I always knew if I applied the same level of discipline and commitment and learning that it, out here as I did when I was in prison, I will not only achieve that goal, I will crush that goal. And I am absolutely content, confident that you can do the same, but it all begins with recognizing I have to invest in myself. I have to reject all of the negativity that is around me, especially that crazy thinking that says, I don't see opportunity. There's always opportunity, even if you're locked in a prison cell, even if you're going through some kind of struggle out here, like you're in a job that you don't really like, or you are, you know, suffered a financial reversal, or suffered a divorce, or suffered some kind of struggle, you can find a way to motivate yourself and make life happen. That is the secret of prison to paradise. There is no passive income. It is all about work. Every time I hear the word passive income, I think to myself, what a moron, right? That's not passive income. Everything that you achieve in success, success requires work. That work may start today and pay dividends tomorrow, but you've got to do the work. And I encourage you, get working today.